Hello everybody, this is Samsung Joy Shion. Today in this video tutorial, this is my first React.js tutorial. Uh, React is a front-end library based on JavaScript. In this tutorial, what we are going to learn is we are going to learn how to make this responsive stylish image gallery by using React.js. When you click on any of those images, you can see the big images show their title of Shion image on and you have description of this image okay you have a, a button with cut okay once again click on another image you can see the title is changed to Sion image 2 and uh, one more thing this is totally responsive just click on this inspect inspect element you can see uh, for now i just added four image you can add lots of images you want okay enough talking let's start at first, go to React.js React official website that is react.js.org. From here, you can see just click on this start. Okay, create create new React app. At first, this is uh, for this tutorial. You need to know basic of HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. You don't need to anything about React.js because in this video tutorial I will try to explain everything from scratch okay or otherwise if you have little bit knowledge of uh, React.js that's totally fine it will help you you need to install Node.js okay go to Node.js official website from there you can you can download Node.js current version or LTS Open PowerShell P O W E R S. Right click on it. Run as administrator. CD forward slash dot dot forward slash dot dot. Okay. CD UAC user. Name of your computer. Sign for me. Desktop. Okay. DIR let me show all the files okay, here we are going to create a react app okay once again go to react.js official website just copy this line and paste it here the last one this my dash app this is the name of our app for now we are going to change it to image gallery wait until the process is finished okay if you want to learn web development or web de design then what you can do the fake lesson search for the fake lesson on youtube from here you can find a channel that this is my channel you can go to playlist from here you can see different playlist i made for you you can learn Node.js, HTML, CSS by using mini project. You can uh, learn Node.js backend programming. Okay, you can learn web designing. Okay, you can learn different framework like Bootstrap, Semantic UI, Materialized CSS. You can learn about Linux, Linux command, or photo manipulation. That's extra for you. You can learn it. Or if you want to uh, if you want to learn full stack web development, then you can follow my tutorial because in future I will upload more and more videos on that. Okay, it will take few minutes to complete the action. Uh, after that, it will give you some suggestion. You can see npm start restart development server. There are different kind of commands you can find from here in the desktop. Uh, remember we name our we name our project to image gallery so we need to go there cd image gallery now we are going to run that command npm start okay it will take few seconds to start you can see for the first time when we run uh, run our development server on localhost 3000 here you can see this will give you by default by react js okay we need to change everything from here and we will build our ui by yourself 
Okay, for this video, I will use Visual Studio Code. If you use any other text editor, that's totally fine. Open your Visual Studio Code. From here, go to File, Add Folder to the Workspace, go to the Desktop, Desktop, Image Gallery, and Add. We need to add the folder. Inside this folder, we have a folder that is Source. Here, we are going to make another folder that will be component because react.js is a component based library so we are going to make everything as a little component of this website okay here we we got few files that the first one we are going to looking for is app.js from here uh, you can see lots of code they given don't worry i'll explain everything delete everything except this root div element because inside this div element we are going to write everything of our website okay now what we are going to do go to index.css here here let's change little bit of style we don't want any padding just write p0 and tab if you are using visual studio code this shortcut will work for you otherwise not we don't want this font family app.css remove all of them we are going to delete the logo.svg from here in index.js you see this is our main folder from here by using react dom we are rendering our app this app is coming from this app okay this app is coming from here just control and click here you can go to the app chase this is what we are writing but we are rendering from index js app okay and doc we are rendering to our root id that is inside our public folder public index.js you can see that this is a html code from here we just uh, they just made a root and in index.js we are selecting this id and inside this id we are going to render our app that is this okay in our app.js we made a function okay that is app return something the return code will be jsx you think uh, this is html but it look like html but it is not it is actually jsx okay in html you need to write code you need to write a class like this but in jsx you need to write class name n is uppercase you see okay inside like uh, inside here what you can do just give a h2 tag but it has lots of similarities between jsx and html okay h2 this is jsx just delete this line save it you see it's showing this is jsx